everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you're new around here, hello and welcome. My name is Kaylee. Today's video is going to be a what I got my kids for Christmas this year. I have a little boy who is seven and a little girl who is five. So everything I've bought is for those kind of age groups. I've got a huge mixture of stuff. Um, I think the cheapest thing is £10 going all the way up to £170. So there's something that suits nearly every budget. We have spent a little bit more this year than we normally would purely because we've had holidays cancelled, days out cancelled, so we've had a bit more extra money to spend. And I think it's just been a really difficult year for everybody, especially the children. They've had so many more rules to follow, so I just thought they really deserved a bit of a treat this Christmas. If you do enjoy the video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And I would also love for you to consider subscribing to my channel. I do lots of different types of videos and I've also got a stocking filler video coming up very soon as well. So grab yourselves a cup of tea, get yourselves comfy. I've got lots to show you, so let's make a start. Okay, I'm going to show you my daughter's things first. So I'll show you everything I've got for her and then I'll move on to the boys stuff. So if you're here for the boys, feel free to skip on ahead to that section. And I'm gonna start with the girls. So the first thing I've bought it's quite big so I don't know how this is going to be her main present so I'm going to try and show you this as best I can okay so the first thing is the Barbie dream house I'll see if I could just pick it up a little bit to show you so it's got this elevator on the side it's got a little swimming pool over the other side a little garage that you can put a car in and it also makes different lights and sounds as well. I think the toilet makes a sound and the oven makes a sound as well. And we got this from Amazon. I've actually been keeping an eye out for this for quite a while because she's wanted it for ages, but it was like 230 pounds, sometimes more. So I've been checking nearly every day to see if it gets reduced anywhere. And luckily I did manage to find it on Amazon for 177 pounds. So I thought that was a really good deal because I was considering getting it second hand and it was still about 150 second hand. So £177 off Amazon. I know Black Friday's coming up, so definitely keep an eye out for offers. I'm out of breath now because that's really heavy. But yeah, I know my daughter will love this. She'll get lots of use out of it. Um, some of the comments I read, the reviews online said that it doesn't sit flush against the wall because of the slide to the pool. So just bear that in mind when you're trying to think of where to put it because it won't sit flush against a wall. So I'm going to have to have to think about where I'm going to put it. But yeah, she plays with Barbies. It's one of her favourite things. So I know she's really going to love that one. Okay, so the next thing we've bought to her is this LOL furniture set. And it's got a little ice cream truck with Bon Bon in. She's actually got um, the OMG doll Candylicious. So she wanted Bon Bon to go with her so she can kind of play mums and babies with her. And I thought rather than buying lots of different balls to try and find her the best way would be just to buy the furniture set so this was from amazon and this was 16.99 we've also got her this kinetic sand bake shop set and this again was from amazon and i think this was 14.99 and this is like a sand that holds its shape and it sticks together and you can make little cakes and things out of the sand so i thought that was quite nice We've also got her this Our Generation clothes set and we've got the pyjamas and dressing gown and the little slippers and this was from Smith's and that was I think it was £16.99. I was trying to find it online but I don't have it online so I can't remember what I paid but I'm sure it was about £16.99. She's got one of the Our Generation girls and one of her favourite things to do is just to strip her off and dress her up again so just another little outfit for her to dress her up in. We've also got her an OMG doll and we've got her the roller chick. This is one that she specifically asked for. It's the one with the pink plaits and she's got little roller skates as well. She seems to prefer these to the smaller LOL dolls, I think, because they're more like Barbies and she loves playing with her Barbies. So she just seemed to prefer the bigger ones. This I got from Argos for £32, but I know it has been on offer quite a lot recently for £24. Um, I think... Amazon had it on offer, um, I think it was Smith's and Argos as well had it on offer recently for 24. I was going to hold out and see if they reduced it again, but it was the last thing I needed to buy. So I thought I'm just going to get it and then I'm done and I can tick it off. We've also got her this present pets. 
and um, we got this from Smith's for £55 but again I think it's starting to come down in price a little bit now we bought it back in October um, I know Asda had it for £40 this week and very I think have it for £48.99 um, so it is a little bit cheaper if you shop around a bit I saw this on TV and I was just drawn into the marketing the actual puppy inside kind of breaks out the box on its own and I just thought that was so clever. And my daughter loves dogs and she really, really wants to get a puppy, but we're not sure if a puppy would suit our family lifestyle. So we haven't made that decision yet, but I thought in the meantime, she's gonna love this. So it unboxes itself and it's interactive as well. I'll see if I can film her opening this on Christmas day and um, put it on my Instagram or YouTube or somewhere so you can see it coming out the box because it does look really clever how it just kind of pops itself out. So that's that one. The next thing we've got here is this totally tiny bakery set. So it's just like miniature baking set and it's got um, a surprise slimy ooze topping and sprinkle topping and caramel ice cream sand. So you can make the little ice creams and things. And I just thought that might work quite well with her Barbie house so she can have like little bits of play food for the Barbies and things. And this one was $17.99 and that was from Smith's. They do also do like smaller sets for less money. I think some were about £10 for the smaller sets. Okay, so moving on to the next thing, we've got her this Minnie Mouse dressing up outfit. And this is just so sweet. We actually got it from the Disney store. Their dressing up outfits do tend to be more money, but they're definitely better quality than some of the other ones you can get. And we got this when they had a discount on, so they had a 24% off discount. So we picked this up for, I think it was nine, just under £20. It was like £19.50 or something. And it comes with the little gloves as well. And to go with that, we got the ears as well. And these again were in the offer 24% offer so they would have been seven pounds and we got them for about five pound thirty I think it was so I thought that was a cute little outfit for her okay and the last thing we've got her is this Paw Patrol Sky vehicle set with the little Paw Patrol figure and this we got from Argos it was actually in their clearance section and we got it I think around October time so it was ten pounds in the clearance and again she had the Sky Paw Patrol figure on her Christmas list so I picked her up this and it makes lights and sounds as well okay so moving on to her brother's stuff we did actually spend a bit less on her brother's although he's got the same amount of presents just because he got the switch for his birthday so he had more spent on him on his birthday so we do try and make it as fair as possible so the first thing we got him was this leapfrog magic adventures globe and we got this from Very, and it was it was eighty pounds, but they had a discount on. I think it was thirty five pounds off a seventy pound spend. Obviously, we spent more than seventy, so we got the thirty five pounds off. So we got it for forty five pounds, and it's an interactive talking globe with more than six hundred BBC videos on it. So what does it say here? So you trigger the videos by tapping on the globe. Um, you can experience new places, cultures, animals, and explore thousands of different facts. And it's got free games, you can solve mysteries and compete with friends in the games. So now he's seven, he's kind of learning a bit more in geography now at school about the world and different countries. Um, so I thought this would be quite handy for him just to learn and watch different videos and learn a bit more about the world. So I thought that was quite a good one for him. Okay, so moving on, the next thing we've got him is this power action. Pikachu. He's really getting into Pokemon recently, in particular Pikachu. So this is something he had on his list. It has light up tail and cheeks. So you squeeze the hand and it makes noises and lights up. So I thought that was sweet. We've also got him the Disney Cars truck and this is for the little mini cars and you do get one with it as well just in the corner there so he's got a few of these mini cars and we're also going to put another one in his stocking as well so this was 14.99 in smith's the next thing is this national geographic gemstone kit and we got this for 6.99 from smith's and you dig out the rock i don't know if you can see there you dig out the rock and there's the gemstones inside 
So you get the little tools as well to dig it out and it comes with three different gemstones. We've also got him this Ryan's World aeroplane set and it also comes with all those figures at the top as well and a few different accessories you can get. This again, I got it from Smith's and it was $29.99. He loves Ryan's World. He watches it on YouTube all the time and he has a few different versions of his toys like the surprise eggs and things like that. So yeah, he's really going to enjoy playing with the aeroplane. Okay, so the next thing we've got him is the Fortnite Battle Bus. He doesn't yet have the Fortnite game. I think he's still a bit young for that, but he does really like playing with the Fortnite toys. Um, so I saw this on Amazon and it was actually reduced to £22. So I didn't think that was too bad. And it comes with two figures as well that can go inside the bus, but we did also get a packet of figures, which I'll show you next. So that's the bus. And then we just got this pack of different figures. And this was £10. And again, we got this from Amazon. So the next thing I picked up from him was this Osborne book and it's 365 science activities. I actually saw this on someone's Instagram. I think it might've been Charlotte Taylor. She showed it on her stories. And I just thought it was really good. And my son is really into science. It's one of his favorite subjects at school. He's always got so much to say about it, always putting his hand up with ideas. So I thought this would be really good for him. It says on the front here, launch your own rocket, make an indoor rainbow. So that's some of the ideas that are inside the book. I'll just give you a quick flick through so you can get an idea of what it's like. So yes, yeah, so many different things to do. So we're really going to enjoy working our way through that. And um, we got this off Amazon and it was £10. We've also got him a Switch game and we got him Hello Neighbour. Again, we got this off Amazon and it was £21.99. He really enjoys watching people play Hello Neighbour on YouTube. So this is a game that he did have on his list. The next thing we've got him is this Marvel Avengers gauntlet with these two action figures. I actually picked this up in the Sainsbury's toy sale for £25, but it is currently also at Argos for £25. Um, and that's reduced from 50, so that's half price. So it's got the gauntlet there in the middle, which you put your hand into and it lights up and makes noises. Okay, and the last thing we've bought my son is this pirate ship. We got this from Smith's and it was 29 99 and it's actually a lot bigger than I thought it was gonna be. Um, it's also got a glow in the dark barrel and it comes with some little figures and a cannon and the ship itself. And I just thought this would be really good for some imaginative play. And he has lots of different figures that would also fit inside the boat as well. So he doesn't have anything like this. So I thought that would be really good for him. So that is everything that we bought them this year. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video and maybe it's given you some ideas or inspiration of what to get. I always find myself watching these kind of videos in the lead up to a birthday or Christmas just to give myself some ideas because it's really hard to know sometimes what to get. And I find it gets harder as they get older as well. I seem to struggle more and more every year. But thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos. Like I said, I do have a stocking filler video coming up and I'll share with you what I've bought my children for their stockings this year. So please keep an eye out for that one. I hope you all have a lovely day and I will see you all again soon. Bye bye.